Hey guys, we are going back to old school shooting in my living room because the light is slightly better here than it is in my bedroom where I just attempted to shoot and the light in my kitchen is even worse. So I hope you guys can sort of see what I'm doing here. But it's almost six, so it's dark outside and I can't shoot outside where I get the best light. That over and done with, I have a friend mail. Sorry my hair is like kind of cruddy too. I was upstairs making some bracelets for my little Facebook shop and some gifties too. And I just now checked the mail at a quarter to six and realized there was a package outside. I'm so stoked because this is a Christmas friend mail from my amazing friend Jeannie. Jeannie spoils me rotten. She has sent me multiple gifts and she is an absolute doll. And if you look through my past friend mail videos and you see friend mail from Jeannie, they are all from my same friend Jeannie, who lives in Virginia, and I adore her. We have not yet met in person, but someday, definitely, it's a bucket list thing. But she decorated it really, really cute with some adorable puffy stickers. We got a Rudolph and a Christmas tree. And is that a snowflake or an ornament? It is a snowflake. We've got some other cute stickers on the side here. There are a few on the top, but obviously I don't want to show you that because that's addresses. But she decorated it so, so, so cute. So I'm going to open it on my lap here so we don't accidentally see addresses. Oh, I think now that I'm back farther, the light's a little better too. Okay, let's see. I see tissue paper on top, and I'm going to try not to look at anything so we can be surprised together. On top is this absolutely gorgeous card how do you know i love elephants i think everybody probably does because elephants are just so beautiful and graceful and precious and basically like harmless i mean i don't think elephants really harm other animals or humans very very rarely if ever I just love them. They definitely deserve to be protected in spite of what some morons might think. But this is absolutely gorgeous. I love it so much. And it's like this beautiful, like Zen, like kind of East, Middle Eastern, like Indian tribal kind of look. It's so gorgeous. And oh, that's actually, oh, okay. It's like a postcard on top of the background. So you could actually remove it. Ooh, see, I'm tempted to junk journal this, but at the same time, I want to frame it. So I think I might just frame it instead. But that's really, really, really cool. And then you write inside, and it just says, enjoy, save the elephants, love Jeannie, F Trump. And I'm not going to show you that part, simply because I know it's going to get my video flagged. Because, you know... Thanks, YouTube, for that, but I completely agree 1,000% with all of the sentiments expressed. I really can't stand that I can't use profanity in my videos anymore, but if I want them to be monetized and have any chance of getting advertising dollars, I have to be a good girl, so I'm doing my best, even though it feels like anti-everything that I believe in and I'm about, but whatever. First up, we have, oh, this is cool. I've never seen these. This is so cool. This is a Mike and Ike lip balm from Taste Beauty, and it is Caribbean or Caribbean, depending on how you want to say it. I say Caribbean because, you know, Billy Ocean can't be wrong, Caribbean queen. But it is Caribbean punch flavored, and it is shaped like the candy box. It is so stinking cute. I'm so stoked to try this. I will definitely be doing a review in a future video. This is just going to be an unboxing right now. Next up we have, oh, this is so fun. Oh, this is so cute. This is a Lip Scoops by Taste Beauty Berry Berry Flavored Lip Balm. And look at how adorable it is. It's a little ice cream cone. And it's blue, because Jeannie knows your girl loves blue. That is so stinking precious. I, I love the holographic packaging too. Taste Beauty was very hit or miss with me for a while, but they tend to be getting on track and I'm liking their stuff a lot more lately. Although I haven't gotten anything really lately from them. So I'm really stoked to try these out. Yay, yay, yay. Thank you, Jeannie. Next up, and I was not expecting this at all, mind you. Oh, this is so cute. This is another Taste Beauty lip balm, and this one is Sour Worms, and it's in like a little mason jar. That is precious. I absolutely love it. That packaging is like legitimately amazing. It's so cute. 
and Taste Beauty. I love that there is no color in this. It's just white. One of my biggest pet peeves with Taste Beauty was always that they put color in their bombs, but they were always, well, not always, but a lot of times they were not attractive, flattering colors. And I always said, if you want to put the color in, fine, but don't make it be pigmented on the lips. So I'm really glad that they made that one white. So yay, happy about that. Next up, oh my gosh, I saw people hauling these and I've never found them. This is a Laffy Taffy, again by Taste Beauty, and this one is Mystery Swirl flavored lip gloss. Oh my gosh, that packaging is everything. I love rainbows, so I'm so stoked about that. I can't believe it. I'm really, 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 really excited to try these. So yay, they're going to go right into my review box, and hopefully I will get to reviewing them quickly. Not like slacking like I've been lately. I apologize for that. Ooh, we got a toy. This is a Littlest Pet Shop, and this one is the Bags and Shoes Collection Series 4. I've never even seen these. How stinking adorable. And we are just going to totally open this right now because I usually, when I do unboxings, I like to just open the pack, it's package and show you what items are in it and not unbox toys or open lip balms or what have you. But... I'm curious, so I'm opening this right now. Does it say how many there are? There are 24 available to collect. And usually the list pet shop is good about putting in checklists, which they did. Is this an ostrich? Oh my God. It's an ostrich, I think. That is so freaking adorable. And it comes with a little basket, like a little, um, like over the shoulder bag that you can carry it in. And then it comes, the accessory is a butterfly. So you can either put the butterfly on the bag. There's a little hole so you can stick it. Oops, let me get the ostrich out so you can stick a little butterfly in the hole. So you can either use it to decorate the bag like so, or there is also a hole in the ostrich's head so you can give her like a little flower, either, like, I mean, a little a flower, like the, the butterfly either is like her hair accessory or like it just landed randomly on her little head. That is so cute. That is one of the cutest little pet shops I have ever seen in my life, like in person or in anyone else's videos. I love it so much. I don't think they name these. I think they just give them numbers. So let's say, so yes, bags and shoes. So that one is a bag one. And yeah, it just has a number. It is number 4042. But if you can get somewhat of a decent look at this, maybe not. Let me see if I can get it close. That might just make it more blurry. But right up there is the one that I got. And I love her. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Jeannie. Thank you. I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, Jeannie always spoils me so rotten. How did you know? Oh my gosh, this is so cool. This, I've never tried anything Hatchimals before. This, though, is a Hatchimals Color Twist Bath Bomb. Magic berry scented with a hidden color inside. So it says you place the fizzy in a tub full of warm water and watch the color change. Rinse with fresh warm water after bathing. Tints your bath, bath water bright colors. This is the first Hatchimals thing I've ever owned, and I'm so stoked, and I love to take baths, so I am really excited to try that. If I remember, I will record when I throw it in the water so you guys can see the color change thing happen, because I think those are kind of fun videos to watch, and it'll definitely be short. Next up, I feel, I think, another lippy. I do. Oh, this is so cute. This is Taste Beauty Rainbow Ice Cream. And can you see that? The ice cream is throwing up a rainbow on both the packaging and the packaging on the actual bomb itself. That is legitimately so stinking cute. I'm so stoked to have this. That's amazing. Amazing, amazing. And there's still more in this amazing box. Okay, let's see what's next. I have no idea what this says. <gasps> Ooh! Shopkins pin pack? Excuse me? They make Shopkins pins now. How did I not know this? I'm collecting pins like a lunatic lately. Both the ones like the enamel pins that you put on like a cork board and you can wear obviously on your clothes and stuff too. But also like the button ones, you know, that have the straight pin that fastens into the little hook in the back. But oh my gosh, I had no idea there were Shopkins pins now. 
and says you can collect them all. They're right there if you want to pause and read them, if that's clear enough. I will also read them to you. There are 12. Apple Blossom, Bagel Billy, Cupcake Chic, Delish Donut, Handbag Harriet, Ice Cream Queen, Cookie Cookie, Lippy Lips, Miss Pressy, Pita Plant, Poppy Corn, or Strawberry Kiss. If I had my choice, simply because I am a New Yorker and I am obsessed with them, I would love to get Bagel Billy, but really there is nobody on this list that I would not be stoked with, especially because I have none, so there's no chance it could be a repeat. I didn't get Bagel Billy, but I don't care. Oh my gosh, you also get a Shopkin too. I got Cookie Cookie. This pin is ginormous. I am so in love with it. I'm going to take it out of the plastic so you can see it better. I wasn't sure which type of pin, if it would be more of a pin pin, like a metal pin or like a button, but I'm so thrilled that it's this type. <gasps> that is freaking epic. I love this pin and it's, it's like, it's metal on the back. I think maybe it's like acrylic on the front, but that is a really nicely made pin. And then there's just the little fastener like that on the back. And you get an actual Shopkin in here too. I didn't realize that because it said one Shopkin inside, but I thought that meant one Shopkin pin inside because I'm not the sharpest knife in the drawer. Oh, and I haven't opened a Shopkin in the backpacks in so long. I'm so excited. Let's see who we got. I haven't opened Shopkins, period, in a while because I've been more collecting Tsum Tsums lately. Not that I don't still love Shopkins, because believe me, I do. And I'm especially in love with that pen. Oh, let's see. Oh, my gosh. I'm trying to remember if I have this one. I don't remember its name, but it's like a little pastry. And I really like it. And I don't care if it's a dupe because I really, really like it. It's so cute. Yay! Oh my gosh, I'm putting it right back in its little puppy backpack. Let me put the other, the trash over to the side here. Put the good stuff over here. And there's still more in this box, I think. There is one more wonderful goodie. I'm looking because I could feel it, like I could feel at the bottom that there was something, but I wasn't sure what it was. Oh my gosh, there's two more things. Oh, wow. First of all, we have a Shopkins sticker pad, which you know your girl is obsessed with stickers. I use them in my junk journal all the time. So we have this page here. We have this page. You can never have too many stickers ever. It's just a thing. This page and this page and they're so cute and I love them but in the very 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 bottom underneath she managed to hide these beautiful three-dimensional stickers which are so pretty we've got flowers this one says life life is beautiful oh my gosh these are absolutely gorgeous Jeannie thank you so 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 much I am so touched and completely shocked because I was legitimately not expecting anything from you. But I never do. You always manage to surprise me when I least expect it. I adore you, girl. Thank you so, 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 so much for your generosity and kindness and amazing friendship. I will definitely be reviewing all the lip balm products. And like I said, if I remember and I don't just dive in, which I may very well because I've had a really bad back for a while now. Right now it's actually hurting a lot. So if I remember to, I will shoot the bubble i'm um, shoot the, the 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 bath water with that bath bomb in it so you guys can watch it change colors if i don't just dive into the bath first because honestly that may legitimately happen but thank you so much for all of these goodies Jeannie. i adore you thank you guys for watching um again i apologize for the light situation but i'm making do because there's no way i could wait till tomorrow <laughs> to open my package because i'm like a little two-year-old and i want it now i'm veruca salt but anyway, thank you so much, you guys, and I will be back. Easy for me to say. I will be back soon with more stuff. Bye.